Imagine a disease so horrible and terrifying it scarred the faces of survivors, and ended the lives of hundreds of millions around the world. For hundreds of years, smallpox was humanity's greatest nightmare, spreading through empires, kings, and even commoners alike. But on October 26, 1977, something revolutionary happened. A quiet victory that marked the end of one of the deadliest enemies in human history. Smallpox wasn't new to society. It had been with us for over 3,000 years, carving its path through human history. It killed pharaohs in Egypt, decimated indigenous peoples in the Americas, and changed the course of empires. Then, in the late 18th century, a country doctor by the name of Edward Jenner noticed something odd. Milkmaids who caught a mild disease called cowpox never got smallpox. His discovery in 1796, the world's first vaccine, lit a spark of hope. Still, eradicating smallpox seemed impossible. It spread fast, ignored borders, and killed about 30% of those infected. But humanity wasn't ready to wave the white flag. Fast forward to 1967, the World Health Organization launched an all-out assault on smallpox a coordinated vaccination campaign spanning every continent in our planet. Doctors, nurses, and volunteers trekked through deserts, jungles, and war zones with one goal. Locate the virus, stop the spread. They used a new tool, the bifurcated needle, cheap, simple, and effective, and a bold strategy called, ring vaccination. Instead of vaccinating everyone, they'd find each outbreak, isolate it, and vaccinate everyone around it, forming a protective ring. It was science meeting strategy. And it worked. In Somalia, October 26, 1977, a young hospital cook named Ali Mal Mullen caught smallpox. Unvaccinated, he developed the telltale rash. Health workers quickly rushed in, isolated him, and vaccinated everyone he'd met. Ali survived. But more importantly, he became the last person on earth to ever contract smallpox naturally. The virus that once shaped civilizations was gone. Three years later, in 1980, the organization declared, smallpox is dead. For the first time ever, humanity had completely eradicated a disease. No miracle drug, no magic cure, just science, optimism and teamwork, and the belief that global cooperation could beat even the deadliest of enemies. Today, we live in a world where smallpox exists only in two labs, under heavy guard. But its story remains a reminder. When nations unite, when science leads, and when humanity refuses to give up, we can do the impossible. October 26, 1977. The day the world finally said goodbye to smallpox.